Afternoon you two, it's me back. A fucking pickups video. Fuck, I can't remember the last time I got a pickups video. Uh, yeah, I'm really gotta stop swearing as well now because some of the kids who I caught in football found out I got a YouTube channel they've started watching, so you gotta stop swearing. So I'll be saying fudge a lot again, I expect. Guys, um, before I start pickups, I'm watching a lot of the button bashers. Like I said, if you haven't watched these two guys, you really gotta get no, we do wins. Watch the funny ass fair play. A cracking bunch from up up north. I'm not saying that I'm in Wales, so anything in up that way's up north to me. Um yeah, so if you haven't checked them out, well if you're watching me you probably know them. But definitely get on them guys, they're absolutely fantastic. Um not the prettiest of blokes, if I'm honest, but uh <laughs> not everyone can be this gorgeous, can they? <laughs> anyway guys right let's get on with some pickups first like i said god knows where these pickups are from like i said i've had so much stuff come in and go out especially the cx and that uh, like i said i've had bits and bobs of retro stuff but i'm gonna clue what what is what so i haven't really shown that it's just stuff i can remember <laughs> picking up since the last pickup video right this one guys i'll show you first I had this a few months back off the missus and it's the art of Atari like I said it is some um, fantastic stuff in here fair play it goes uh it's a bit heavy guys and I'm not really the strongest over this with one hand you know what I mean let's have a look it's fine over here that it might might like say come on find the page oh you are space for that fucking door you are some of the artwork in your guys is absolute fantastic fair play because i'm not sure where um the enemy got it from but it come with a t-shirt as well it did you are it's full fight today some of you might remember that du, 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 du. let's have a look Pengo. oh you are now you're talking another pm junior park bar yeah like i said some really uh some really cool stuff in here guys so if you haven't seen it and I, I highly recommend you getting it. Now look, it's um forward by Ernest Klein. Obviously, Ernest Klein massive now. They're from Ready Player One and um fanboys and that. So yeah, fair play. Right then, guys. A couple of months back, I was on holidays in Florida, and the only thing I brought back, which what did we do? We went and seen it. Um, what was it? it was it in Disney? Yeah, it was in Disney. Or was it Universal? Anyway, God, probably should be a universal, I think. This um, makeup show, like how they do all the blood and gore. Now. As we come out, we went through a thing and I seen her. Uh, well, I didn't know what's happening. Mrs. Mrs. Norton, she went, oh, what do you think of that? I said, oh, that's cool. I said, oh, I'm having that. And I just expected to say no, I'm going to put it back. And she said, yeah, go and grab it then. And she, oh, she went for a bigger one now. That's a little gizmo. Oh, I think he's cool as hell he is. Obviously, I'm trying not to get him wet and feed him after midnight. <laughs> then he's over there with my uh, my Funko Pops. And like I said, he's a cute little fucker, isn't he? A cute little fudger, he is. <laughs> right then, where are we going to go next? So, yeah, I had a big lot of stuff. Give me off one of our, well, one of the girls who plays fuck me now. Her dad helped me out with the coaching. And they come to train one. They had a big, massive bag of stuff. That's all up in the Arctic. All like PS2 stuff and that. And two PS2s in there. But one of the games I kept down, one of the modernest ones, is uh, Ratchet and Clank. Oh, I don't remember which one it is. Yeah, G Force. I said, I'm not a chance to play it yet, but let's be honest, the Ratchet and Clank game. Ratchet and Clank games are good anyway, they saw. So, oh, I used to have that game. Panzer Dragoon Order. It's a good fucking game, that is. Obviously, the stuff I'm showing is not as good as what the boys are showing there, so. I don't know where to keep it going because they're going to outdo me every time. <laughs> yeah, so that's uh, Ratchet and Clank right then. Next one up is my daughter's. But I've had a little go and it's absolute brilliant. Honest. Like I said, the Retro Bay would like something like this. Well, that's another one to check out, guys, if you haven't. The Retro Bay. If you like your pickups and one of the most is it charismatic people obviously just his personality and his persona you just get up watching him and he's fabulous fair play with the guys but that's uh just dance 2019 
as I say, I've been throwing a bit of shapes to this because I'm on a diet, I've been helping out with that as well. So as God, like I said, you probably can't notice there, I've lost a bit of weight. It's a little bit more to go, but we'll get it. Uh, so that's Just Dance 2019. Next one up, my boy wanted this and it looks a good game. And that is Marvel and the Mac Alliance 3. Oh, so is it in here or is it in Switch? Oh no, it's in it at the moment, it's got to go. Characters in the day now, so that's a... Like I said, I haven't played it yet, but it looks, looks half decent. Right, these ones just from a while back. So I'm not sure if I was with Matman when I bought, bought this. Oh yeah, I picked up another Xbox 360 as well. Another one parked in there, that was with Matman hours. I'm not sure if it was at the start of this year or last year. God knows, anyway, no way I'm showing it, but I'm sure I got this way. Like I said, it was in CX, I think it was only 50 pence, something like that. That's all in front. Now, first time I played this, I absolutely loved this game. Try not to get any played on it. And, yeah, definitely, for like your first person shooters, definitely give that a go. I think cheap as chips and well worth a play through. Next one up. I really fancy playing this again, so I re-bought it. So when I first bought it, I think it was like 60 quid, I think this game was. She was like 60 quid. But anyway, I picked up for the pound in CX. That was Halo 4. Except I'm talking through the back, everyone knows what Halo is, isn't it? Um, do, 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 do. Right, a couple of PS4 games now. And the first one up, like I said, I added on the 360 and I loved it. Well, when I got my 360 back, this game come with it. I'm so happy it did. Like I said, you, you probably know, you probably played it, but if you love Gears of War and Duke Nukem, definitely I recommend getting Bulletstorm. It's been oh, an awesome game, guys. Fair play, really, really got it. Love if you made a sequel of that. Next one up, I said I haven't played this yet. That's Uncharted, The Lost Legacy. Like I said, if it's going Uncharted, it's got to be half decent, haven't it? Oh, is that outgun too, innit? Yeah, it's been a fantastic game, that is. I just wonder what my cat's doing a bit. Where are you doing, fat cat? Psst, psst. Where are you doing? Who can jump down from here now and hit that over? I'll be out in the rain. Not be raining at the moment, but I'll be peeing down. Right, next one up, guys. I've only played a little bit this so far. But half decent fair play. And that's Days Gone. So if I haven't played it, I'd uh, recommend you give it a little go. Next one up, I said one I'm busting to play. But I've started another game. I want to finish our game before I get into anything else. And that is Horizon Zero Dawn. I said another CX pickup. So... That's why we heard really good things about and I'm looking forward to giving a go. So most of my pickups these days come from CX, I think. Yeah. Right then, for showing the next games, I'm going to show you what I got to play them on. And, like I said, there was a certain game coming out, which I really, really wanted to play. But, we had two, well, actually, what is first, maybe? The Xbox One. Obviously, it's just a box, because the Xbox down with it. So, really, really wanted to play I'm the game now, but yeah, Gears 5. I said, when everyone's seen Gears 5 now, haven't they? Yes, awesome game. Um, really wanted to play Gears, but the only thing, I never had a, a PS4. An Xbox One down here, but the kids got them in their bedroom. But you know, it's like trying to play games in your kids' bedrooms is hard work. So I thought, bugger it, I just got a whack of stuff that I wasn't using, I wasn't going to use anymore, and just took it to CX. And ended up getting that. We have, I bought obviously Gears 5 brand new. Thought I got that from shop2.net. Gears 5. It was the cheapest place I could find it. But, so yeah, because I got the Xbox One, so I wanted to play it down here. And, oh, I should really show you a game. Download the game on Game Pass because I had an offer on. I think it was two months of Game Pass for £2. So I thought, oh, yeah, we'll give that a go. So I done that. And was it, oh, Guyana Sisters. Twisted Dreams or something like that. Twisted Dreams, something like that. My favourite is a cracking little game, really addictive. So I, I do reckon I'm giving that a go. So yeah, so because I got Halo 4, not so long back, really wanted to try Halo 5. Now my boy Tyler had this a while ago, but obviously because I didn't have the Xbox One down the earth, I thought I'm uh, not playing that in his bedroom, but so I picked up that was a five at house. I thought, I don't need to five. I'll be there. We'll try a bit of Halo 5, say. Next one up was 
So we have some decent things about this. So I thought I'd give it a go on, except from the back, it looks really, really good. Is World War Z? World War Z? Z? Not in Z, Z. Oh, in America now, my. <laughs> no offense to any hello cousins from over the pond watching. Yeah, World War Z or Z, wherever you want to see it. Um, yeah, that's that one. Next one up, one is really. Well, I was interested in, but my boy was banging on and on and on and on and on and on and on about it because he got really into series now. He absolutely loves it. And that's a Mortal Kombat 11. Like I said, I watch him play a bit of it. I, it's another one I haven't played yet. Looks half decent, so I'll give it a go now. But to me, I played, was it 10 or X? The last one came out before that. And it was good. It wasn't quite as good as 9, I thought. To me, Mortal Kombat 9. Apart from the first one, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 9 is the best out of the lot. Fantastic. So yeah, that's that, guys. So, last thing I bought then, which if you follow me on Twitter, you would have seen it. This is the only retro thing in here, really. The artist back in the day, and I had to get it back. Like I said, one of these games that on my mind to get. And when I seen it on Fair for that, I just chucked a two pound bid on eBay for it. And as it happened, I ended up winning it. That was. Die Art Trilogy, like it's a little crack in the case there, but no, don't worry about that. Everything's in the manual, so forget how heavy these games <laughs> used to be. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to playing Die Art with a Vengeance on it. We're driving around New York, busting a give out and go. So, yes, guys, that's my pickups. Like I said, obviously, I've done pick up a lot now. Like I said, I will be picking up some more bits and bobs. But what I want to do now, the games I got, like I downsized loads, my Master System, Mega Drive stuff, and that. The games I got now are the ones I had from when I was a child. Not the original games, the ones I bought back. Some of them are in the best condition, so I will be trying to upgrade. Like get manuals when I haven't got manuals. Like I said, if I can find a better copy. I got Psycho Fox up here and it's not really in the greatest condition. So I will be looking to swap to swap down out in time if I can find some copies cheap enough. Like, but yeah, that's, that's about it. Like I said, uh, Starting to get back into you two as I score challenge now. If anyone haven't got involved with that, jump in, have a look. Oh, sorry, a bit of wind. All good fun. So, yeah, cheers for watching, guys. Hope you're all doing well. And I'll catch you in the next one. All the best.